it is like 12 30 midnight and i am on the gucci site trying to decide what size belt to get i've been thinking about this for a minute and i just want to make a luxury purchase i feel like i just want to do something for myself i want to do something nice for myself and yeah so I'm looking at all these videos and I have no idea what size to get. So from the videos I did see, you're supposed to measure your waist in centimeters, but right now I am so freaking bloated. So at my bl most bloated state, cause I feel like my stomach is just like completely distended. It's 110 centimeters. So I'm thinking like, okay, should I do 110 because I'm bloated and it'll give me some extra room? Or should I go to 115? I just don't know what to do. I'm scared. Because <laughs> I feel like, you know, to spend this type of money and then get the wrong size, I would be completely pissed. You know, I just want everything to go good. But this is the belt that I am getting. Um, so I'm going to get the pebbled kind of textured one instead of the smooth one. And then I'm also going to get like the, mm, not shiny GG, but the kind of like brassy looking one. It's just like a little more on the, you know, more muted side. So, um, yeah. So this is the sizing right here. It goes to the biggest size is a hundred and 20 so um oh this one the biggest size is 115 the smooth one was um 120 so i think i'm just gonna go with the 110 and say a prayer and hopefully it works out and later on i'll be able to do some kind of unboxing for you guys so yeah I'm excited. See, now this is making me even more skeptical because it's saying if you're a US, oops, if you're a US 20, which I am, then you should get the 115. But then when I measure my waist, it says I should get the 110. I don't know because I don't want it to be too big. I want it to, you know, I'm going to wear it high waisted. So. This is for high watt, high rise, and yeah, <laughs> I don't know what to do. I'm gonna go with the 115 to make sure. I feel like it has the notches on the belt, so I should be able to tighten it how I want to. So yeah, okay. So I am here in where we are in Carson, California, and I'm getting some I have no business getting. Me. My son and Nicole, you guys know Nicole, bestie. Hey guys. <laughs> Did I zoom in? I zoom directly in. <laughs> I didn't mean to. There she go, there she go. She got her Oreo, her and Trent got Oreo shakes. And I got cake batter with, what? Oh, with pie crust and caramel. Tomorrow I'm starting keto. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, I'm in a hot ass mess, but I figured like, okay, I went to a wedding. I ate crazy at the wedding. Like, I'm like, shoot, I'm just gonna finish this weekend on out. And I probably shouldn't do that. And I say that on my other channel, but today, listen, I'm gonna go ahead and finish it on out. And now we're about to go to Ikea and go look at a few things. We're really into like home improvement. And we have several projects that we kind of start in not necessarily finished <laughs> so we're trying to work on that and trying to get better on that so right now we just want to go look at some cute stuff and see what we might want to pick up kind of do maybe some window shopping and pick up some small things we don't know yet so we will see and my baby said he wants to hang out with us so Aww, that's so what we're gonna do yeah uh-huh <laughs> This is the line to get in IKEA. Yeah. So you know we must really want to come in. <laughs> I just got the
This would be really nice, baby. Maybe I can do this to give me an idea of what to do for your room. I got the PlayStation. I need to. This is giving me ideas. You know, I have to see exactly. But look at they got the shoes, babe. But it was in con. My words, then. Yeah, that's probably what I would get him. That's what he got now. That's a cool pegboard. What's this? I like this little lamp. $24.99. That's nice. How do I get this if I wanted it? I'm thinking about getting this one, you guys. I'm thinking about putting one of these in each end of my closet just for some extra room. Um, I already have the mom dresser in my office. I don't have a dresser in my actual bedroom because my bedroom is not done. I'm just kind of looking at all the options of dressers here. I kind of like this one too, but I would probably change the knobs on it to like a more girly type of knob. And I also need something for my son as well. Y'all, yes, this is the mom dresser right here, which I like which I already have, which I think I might just put it in my bedroom as well and my son's room. I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna change it up, but I just like that it's sleek, it's modern, and you know, it just goes well with things. find the ones I was looking for. I ended up getting something that I want to spruce up my patio with so or actually I want to work on a patio makeover because my patio is this dry girl. It ain't nothing happening. But they got so much freaking cute stuff. I just wish Ikea would just hit me up like what do you want for free? Please take it. <laughs> but yeah. I'm looking Oh, that's the 24 by 36 right here. This is what I need. The 24 by 36 frame. That's what I'm looking for. I want to get three of these. However, oh, I think I want to get them in black. Okay. Yes, yeah, so I want to get some frames for my living room. Okay, I think I'm going to pick up this and get three of these to hang over my um, my dining room couch. That's what I'm thinking. I feel like I want this. Okay, you guys, so I got three of the frames here. And yeah, you think this will fit in the car? My best friend. <laughs> So it is early in the morning and I am up shopping on Amazon Prime Day. I love a good deal. Black Friday, Cyber Monday, all of that jazz. So I am online now trying to see if I can get some good deals on some home things and girl, really whatever else I see. This is one thing <clears throat> that I'm eyeing on because it kind of matches my decor in my den area, which is like um gray and gold so i'm thinking these would look really nice on my fireplace and when i'm looking at the reviews all of the reviews are really really good 
and they just look so cute look how cute <laughs> so yeah I think I'm gonna pick these up and yeah let me try to see what else I gonna pick up hopefully I can do like an Amazon haul for you guys to let you know what I picked up on Amazon Prime Day <laughs> y'all look what just came in the mail <laughs> I'm so excited, okay? First of all, I came in this box that this looked like this is a regular old Spangler box, and I'm like, who is this from? And it doesn't say Gucci, and I'm pretty sure, what does it say? It just says e-commerce. It doesn't tell you, like, where it's from, and I feel like they do that on purpose, just in case somebody tries to steal it or something. But yay, I'm just leaving it in the box as it is right now until I'm actually ready to do an unboxing. Today is just kind of like a chill day. Girl, I'm just recuperating from the weekend. So once I am ready, I'm going to do an official unboxing. But I'm so happy. <laughs> okay, you guys. So I have been wanting to do something different with my hair. I've been wanting to do like a half up, half down type of hairstyle. Um, but all those tutorials that I saw, girl, just seemed like it was difficult. So I was trying to see if there was some kind of easy option. So I went looking on YouTube and I saw this instant up and down, um, half wig with a ponytail wrap. And, you know, some of them came out looking really cute. Some of them was like, hmm, I don't, I'm not sure. But for the most part, I would say it was like, uh 90 10 percent like 90 percent of them came out looking pretty cute so i decided to go ahead and buy so i bought this with my own coin um i got this from ebonyline.com so i am going to try this out and see how it looks i've been wanting to wear just like I mean, even though this is in my hair, I've been wanting to wear my hair out, like even if it's in a ponytail um, instead of wearing a wig recently. So I'm hoping that this comes out looking cute. Yes. Yes, indeed. And then I got it in a number one. I'm not exactly sure why I did that because my hair is not a number one, but I do have some stuff that I put on my edges to make them darker, which is like a number one. So I'm hoping that everything will kind of mix together. So we will see. I'm about to like section off my hair and just do the front part of the ponytail. And then hopefully I can come back and show you a couple clips of how I put it all together.
guys so this is the finished look and i'm absolutely loving it girl like i think the hardest part is just actually getting your own ponytail together and once you get that laid i mean it took me about a little bit less than 10 minutes to do this ponytail and it's the completely new style you ain't gonna do all this extra nonsense super quick and that's what i like about this um now the only thing i will say is that when it's time to wrap your ponytail the only thing you have is like a little small tiny comb so it actually doesn't really have that much structure when you're wrapping the piece around it kind of almost feels loose so i had to kind of pinch it together and then um pin it as i was putting it in um but other than that i mean it's cute and it's a whole different style it's something that's different for me i never really wear an up like type of do if i do wear my hair in a ponytail it's normally low so i am loving this so much you guys and i think that i paid 30 dollars for this and then plus you know shipping and stuff i think it was like another 10 dollars. so altogether it was 40 dollars, but i feel like it's worth it for an instant hairstyle and if you really kind of or just wearing it for a short time you might be able to preserve it and wear it a couple of times so yes you guys this is the finished look <laughs> let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below okay you guys so this is my first look i'm shooting in my serving chocolate tea listen join the movement sis if you're interested in this top i'll have the link in the description box below for you guys but yeah this is the first look okay guys so i'm almost ready to wrap up today um i just have a couple of looks for dianu and i think i'm going to maybe film an intro to a video and yeah i'm almost done and the ponytail held up girl i'm loving it okay you guys so i figured that since i still have my lights and stuff up from earlier i was like i might as well do the gucci belt unboxing um so it did come in the mail i think i showed you guys how it came it came so inconspicuous is that the word this is how it came nowhere on the box does it say anything like gucci it just says like e-commerce or something like that so yeah it comes in a box like this but Once you open it, this is what you see. Isn't it so cute? I don't even know if I showed all of it. <laughs> but you guys, I'm so excited because this is my first luxury purchase. Um, and yeah, so I'm a little bit excited. <laughs> Girl, you know I'm going to keep this bag. So this is what the bag looks like. <clears throat> Y'all, yeah, I'm excited. Okay, so it has a little tie that's kind of keeping it closed. Oh, wait, oh my gosh, there's something else in the box y'all isn't this so freaking cute i'm happy this, i love this packaging with a little bow on it it, is, it just feels like i'm opening up a present and this is a present it's a present to myself okay i never really buy anything for myself like you know i don't i really don't buy anything for myself like i told you guys i'm not really into like the latest phones and stuff like that so i don't really buy anything i mean as far as i mean clothes i i get clothes all the time so that's not something that i really buy other if i wasn't that's what i would be buying i would be buying clothes but since my line of work i don't really have to buy clothes so i'm like why not treat myself 
every once in a while to something that I truly want. So this was one thing I truly wanted. So I went ahead, I took the ribbon off. Before I opened up the box, there was something in here. It's a letter that's Gucci. Don't drop, don't drop the box now. <laughs> so there, there is um, a letter in here or something. Let's see what it says. Or what it is. Okay, so it says, thank you for shopping with us at Gucci.com. We hope that you enjoy your Gucci purchase. Each item has been skillfully designed and made using the highest quality materials by Italian artisans. Please contact us if you have any questions. And we look forward to assisting you again at Gucci.com and in our Gucci stores. And so it has the number and the email. And then, oh, it has like the return process and then it has a return label if you know i decide to return so girl i don't know oh it, i was gonna say it is a little letter here i was gonna say i don't know why i thought it was a letter but it is actually a little letter kind of explaining the returns and saying thank you for shopping at gucci so yeah okay so now on to our unboxing y'all i can't really see me opening it <clears throat> so this is what it looks like on the inside it's just wrapped in tissue paper with a little sticker that says Gucci oh I'm excited I feel like it's Christmas girl Okay, so it looks like the belt comes in this cute little dust bag. It's like an ivory color and then it says Gucci. <clears throat> and I hope you got, I got the right size, you guys, because I was really going back and forth as to what size I should actually get. So this is the... The dollar pig print double G Marmont belt and I got it in size 115 Lord it looks long okay it looks long but I'm hoping that it fits good and I don't have to do any type of return um, when I did measure my waist I was super bloated and it was at 110 so I was tempted to get 110 or 105 but I was like you know what let me just get 115 just to be sure because when I looked at the measurements of the entire length of the belt I think it was like 50 no 46 or something like that so I was like hmm oh oh my gosh y'all I'm happy okay so it's the double G buckle and I decided not to get the shiny one because I just didn't know how shiny it would be. I felt like this would kind of go more with more things and just kind of be muted and a little bit understated. So I ended up getting the kind of like brass one instead. And then I also got like the textured one instead of the um, smooth one. I feel like um, the textured one would probably show a little bit less imperfections and all of that so that's why i decided to go with this one after watching a couple of videos so it does have um three belt holes no i'm sorry so it does have five well yeah it has five belt holes so let's go ahead and see how this fits i'm probably going to be wearing it high-waisted anyway so yeah see <clears throat> girl this, this camera zoomed directly in on my waist okay why does it look like it was rolled the wrong way Ew, girl I got the right size I'm on the I probably could have got the 110 because I'm just let's see I'm on the very last hole and it's still not really tight 
so when I do wear it on my waist, you know, it's gonna it's gonna fit, but it's not gonna be super tight. Um, I don't know. So when I do have it like cinching the waist, like if I have a dress or something that's cinching the waist, then it will not um, be too tight. Um, you know, I'm just not sure. I feel like maybe I could have did the 110. I probably should have went with the 110 just in case. But you know what? One thing I do like is that if I decide not to wear high waist and I wear it just with some regular jeans and I wear it, you know, around the belt loop, I should be able to fit it down lower as well. So I'm happy about that. But I just wish I had one more hole left. I do feel like I could take it somewhere and get an extra hole if I do lose weight and want it tighter. Um, so yeah, because you guys know that I'm on a weight loss journey. But yes, I'm absolutely in love with it. Oh my gosh, you guys. I cannot wait to style this. I cannot wait. You understand? <laughs> I'm happy and ever since I made this purchase I have been itching to buy a bag now so yeah I think that'll be my next thing let me know if you guys are interested in these type of videos interested in like luxury hauls and stuff like this and unboxings so that you can kind of see how things would be if you decide to purchase let me know so yeah i'm so excited about my purchase i'm very very happy and you will be seeing it on future outfits but yeah you guys i'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here and until my next video have a blessed day have a blessed week and i'll see you in my next one bye